It's true. You've been lied to your whole life. The body mass index, or BMI, has been used for decades to decide whether or not you are overweight. It's measured by dividing your weight by your height squared to find out how much excess body fat you might have. I say might because it's so full of red flags that we should have ditched it years ago. BMI was developed in 1939, not for health reasons, but to streamline measurements of the average man for statistical analysis. Red flag number one. Red flag number two, the creator, Adolf Ketelet, was not a doctor or any kind of health professional at all. He was a mathematician. So how did BMI make the jump to the medical world? Psychologist Ansel Keys said it was the best test to measure body fat. Again, not a medical doctor. Red flag number three. BMI has one other huge flaw. It can't actually tell you how much body fat you have. You know, the whole reason we use it today? The index can't distinguish between muscle and fat. Even Ketelet admitted his test was bad at measuring accurately for body fat. That's our fourth red flag. And here's red flag number five. The test can't account for gender or genetics. Two huge factors in determining how your body holds weight. Man, BMI is just bullshit.